So here's a quick tip on how to mount a power strip to a wall. There are a couple of things that you can do. Uh, if you can go, if you have a copy machine and you can go ahead and do a copy of the backside, you'll get something like this. And that's one of the easiest way to do it. If you don't have a copy machine, the other thing that you can do is just put any piece of paper and then use any sort of a pencil or a tracing instrument to just go ahead and trace the back of the uh, power strip plate and just go ahead and mark exactly where those holes are. Even if you do have uh, a copy of the power strip, you can still go ahead and mark where the holes should be. And now we'll go ahead and either apply the copy or the trace paper, whichever method you used, but we need to flip it. And that's why I said earlier to use the black marker to mark where the holes are. It makes it even further easier to see uh, where to put the screws in. We'll go ahead and apply that with some sort of an adhesive tape or so, just in order for us to make sure that it is leveled. And it is perfect. And now we can go ahead and put the screws in. Once we put the screws in, we'll actually go ahead and take them out and now we have enough space in order to put the drywall anchors in. This way, when you're plugging and unplugging the appliances, the screws are not going to come out easily. Just leaving a little bit of, of space. Okay, now with the screws being in the anchors, we can go ahead and mount the power strip. And I'll have to rewire the wires and organize them a bit better, but all right, all set and it's all good to go. That's how you do it.